We've got this 21 Silverado 2500 up in the air and this truck is a monster. We're gonna be making it even bigger today by installing Rough Country's five inch kit with some 35 inch tall tires. I wanna show you under the hood here what's going on. We are under the truck and have everything blown apart. As you can see, we've got most of the suspension components on the floor, the lower control arms, axles, rotors, hubs, knuckles, all that kind of stuff. If you didn't know, uh, Chevrolet has used a torsion bar in their 2500 series trucks for a long time. And this torsion bar right here is the spring and it functions by twisting. So what we're gonna be doing is installing the five inch rough country kit earlier, like I said, and what is included in that kit are two big differential drop brackets that we'll show you once we get them installed. You do have to cut the frame on this truck, so you'll notice we've got a template all cut out, laid over here, and we are gonna lop this right off, and that'll allow us to drop in the new bolt-in bracket that is required from Rough Country. We're also gonna be installing new knuckles, so you'll see that we've got the hubs and rotors attached to these steering knuckles. These things are heavy, but these knuckles will also be replaced by a taller knuckle. One thing I really like about this particular kit and most of these big differential drop kits is that with the new taller knuckle, it keeps the lower control arm, upper control arm, axle shaft, and steering all at the exact same angles as they were from factory. That means the truck is gonna drive, handle, and be reliable just like a factory truck and that's all what we want. We got a time lapse set up, so we're gonna show you the whole install, what it looks like. We're gonna be putting some 35 inch ridge grapplers and some fuel vandals that are 20 by 10s on this thing. It's gonna look killer when it's all wrapped up. We've got the Chevy 2500 all wrapped up. The alignment turned out perfect. We also aimed the headlights so everything is squared up. This thing looks incredible. Five inches of lift on these trucks really make them stand tall. So we've got a 20 by nine fuel wheel. It is the Vandal and it looks killer. I really like the gloss black wheel with the milled edges. I think it really contrasts on this truck really nice. So uh, what do you think? Let us know in the comments section below about this truck. If you have any questions about your truck, be sure to hit us up. Or if you want us to transform your ride, by all means, let us know. Be sure to subscribe and hit the bell for notifications on YouTube. Also, check us out on Facebook and Instagram. Thanks for watching. See you next time.